Shout out to Tari and Rain. Thank you for your hard work, man. You put in work a lot. Even, even when you're at work and you come home from work or whatever, you still have enough time to basically make stuff for us to know as far as like news for us. You've always found time to basically like cater to us, man. I really appreciate that. Don't let these jack wrenches get you down, man. I'm sure you're not down, but I just wanted to emphasize that. You know, I first found out about you from Professor Black Truth, and so I had, I, and, and ever since then, I've always looked forward to your content. Um, you know, I just don't let these snowflakes get to you. These are the same snowflakes that will talk about free speech, but yet they want to demonize your speech. And, and, and try to silence you. That's a white supremacist, you know, for you. <laughs> I tell you, you know. Um, also, thank you for the times that I know I send you stuff here and there. Um, but thank you for the times that, like, you've actually talked to me and, and responded. You know, I really appreciate that. Um, that dialogue. You know, you've had a lot of effect on uh, on a lot of people. Sorry. You've had a... A massive effect on a lot of people man and it's hard for me to even put in words it's a good thing you know we don't have our own media you know um and and this is the closest to it you professor black truth lisa cabrera thought crimes you know those are the homies um chris crazy house jason black Tariq nasheed i mean the list goes on you know it's just <sighs> youtube in their I would call it false flagging, even though <laughs> they, you know, they could get away with people, you know, doing a lot of things that they shouldn't be doing and, and not flagging them. Like all these white supremacist <clears throat> channels on YouTube, none of these people are getting taken down. Black Pigeon, Red Ice TV, Jared Taylor, all of them, Colin Fartery, all those guys, they've not been taken down. And it's a shame. Because what you're doing is you're informing us and these people are trying to basically promote our genocide, which is horrible, you know. And But yet, no one goes after them. There should be people that flag them. There needs to be because it's just wrong. But you know what, man? Keep doing what you're doing, man. Like, for a person that, from what you told me, what I remembered when I asked you if you have a journalist degree or whatever, man, you're like a recon journalist. If, I mean, for a person that, that says that they have no background in that, you pretty much made your background, bro. That's like, you're on some recon journalist type stuff, man. And it's cool to know also that you're a fellow comic book nerd like myself. I used to be more than I am now. I check in every now and then to see what's going on. But back in the late 80s and early 90s, that was me. Actually, through the whole 80s. Um, anyway, man, I just wanted to give you a shout out and I'm going to go to Black Junction TV because of you. I didn't even know that existed until you talked about it, you know? Um, so yeah. And also thank you for hipping me to Lisa Cabrera and, you know, Chris Crazy House. <laughs> you know, it's really, it's a trip, man. It's, it, I love seeing our people deliver the news the way it should be about things that we know and what that we've been through you know we have all come together through your guys's platforms you know anyway man I, I i thought it was something else that i was gonna say but i forgot what it was but keep on rocking madness man i pray the best for you bro that means god bless you in Amharinya, that's an Ethiopian language. Peace to you, man. I'm serious. Keep on rocking that madness and don't let these snowflake behind people get you down.